All right, let's create a metallic pillow or a pillow in general, and then we put on the metallic shader on it. So we can create a plane or cube and we make a shape of the pillow we want and make sure to have the pillow quite thin like this. Then we press Ctrl A to scale it. Then we press Ctrl R, left click, right click. Then in here we type in 75. We do the same here. Add a blue cut, right click and 75. Then we also need a loop cut here, and we can do it like this. Then we need to go into object mode, and then add a cloth. Then we want pressure set to 1, and the field weights. And in here, we turn down the gravity to 0. Then the only thing we have to do is press play in the timeline, and the pillow will form. Right here, I feel satisfied with the look. So in the modifiers, I will apply it and I can shade out smooth. It still looks like this blocky texture. So we add a subdivision surface modifier. And uh, that's about it. We have a pillow. But for to make the texture we want, we will turn up the metallic and the roughness to 0.3 then in the specular we turn up this and this to 0.6 or 5 then to be able to see anything we need to change from EV to cycles and I will just put in some values here to make it easier for my computer then we need a plane we can scale this pillow down and set up a scene for our pillow so we make a wall like this we control b level scroll the mouse wheel then we can press s or x to move it like this then we can shade it out to smooth then we need lights i use area lights move them up turn up the power a little bit then we can copy and rotate like this and to be able to see our result we will go into this shader viewport and we are start seeing some some texture and we can also click ctrl b here in the viewport and we get this thing here and we can left click and drag it across the screen and only render specific parts to make it, the contrast even more visible i will put a dark texture or color on the plane and uh, that's about it hope you like this video and if you want to see more of these videos don't forget to subscribe and i will see you in the next video